Welcome to Dependable Flame, where we explore vintage petrol lighters, ashtrays, tobacchiana, and other useful mechanisms. Make yourself at home. Okay, so today's video is going to be a little bit different. I want to um, take you on a little tour here <clears throat> from one of my videos show you my channel here it's the way it looks to me anyway so let's say we're gonna go here to the this auctions about to end so we'll go take a look at it right now sort of maladies um, so you got the video right here, and all then all underneath it, lighters in, yeah. you've got the information. There's going to be links underneath all my videos, and the one, these sort of videos, lighter videos, not the repair videos, the actual ones talking about the lighters, that's usually going to take you to the current eBay listings page. which when we get over there on the dependableflame.com website then you're going to find a link to our ebay store there at the top as we scroll down here then you're going to find it, the individual listings for each lighter so to go take a look here um, some of these are formatted a little bit better than others and um, kind of learn as i go here so It'll be a little bit smoother as we go along. But to look at this individual listing here, say for the 1956, vintage 1956 brush chrome Zippo lighter with mismatched insert, there's the YouTube video embedded on the website. If you want to get a closer look at any of these uh, images, then you just click on the thumbnail. And it's going to get you right up close and personal. Um, if you're interested in purchasing one of these lighters or bidding on, as this one is an auction, not a uh, buy it now, uh, make offer listing. Um, but this one was an auction. So if you're interested in making an offer on a lighter or, or, uh, buying a lighter or bidding in an auction then you just click on either the heading for that lighter or where it says click to purchase this lighter from so we click here on the heading it takes us to this active listing that uh, has 24 watchers 22 bids right at the moment from there you can bid on the lighter um, you're going to see a different look obviously of the listing than I am you're going to have the ability to bid where I have control of the listing um, so that's basically how that works for each listing um, now once you get over there if you were to click on say um, say this late 1940s early 1950s Zippo uh, golfer and you get over there and you see the price of that and you say 124.99 this guy's lost his mind um, don't fret about that if you want to make an offer on this lighter make an offer on the lighter uh, when I list them I don't necessarily um, do all the homework up front. It's more important to me to get the, the listing up, uh, especially on the website, to get the pictures up, um, the article, the video, whatever else I've got going along with it, and it is to get that, the price perfect on that lighter to begin with. Um, I don't do auction starts on valuable lighters because 
um, I did that at first and you get ripped off. You don't get value in by starting auctions low and just letting people bid or even starting near the value. Um, it just doesn't work as well. So I'm basically working that at, from the other end. I list it high. I'm not trying to list it exorbitantly high. I'm just listing it, um, trying to list them a little high so that I don't lose value on the lighter. And then I'm on a field offers. I take I'm, the make offer button is active on every one of my listings. If it's not, there's a reason. And there are some there. I've had listings before. You could, there are lighters that I've had for sale, um, a cigarette case or two. There are some things that um, over time became more valuable to me than the price that somebody else was going to pay for them. So that's just part of it. Um, not all of them are like that, though. The vast majority of these lighters, I'm, I want to sell and I'm going to sell. I just, I'm just not in a big hurry. I ha I can afford, um, I can afford to take my time, and, um, you know, obviously, I'm making videos about them. I'm, I'm making instructional videos on how to repair them. I'm trying to milk every last, um, bit of content that I can out of these lighters. So I'm not real concerned about selling them in a hurry. So you see a high price, please don't be offended. Um, and when you make an offer, if you send me a low ball offer, I'm not going to be offended at that either. Um, but also in return, don't be offended if I don't respond. If I just let that die there in the inbox, I, I don't have time to, to actually respond to every offer um, a lot of them I'll let die a lot of them I will counter offer um, I'm fair you can look at my uh, reviews well let's go look at my reviews you look at my feedback rating as a seller it's all outstanding now you'll see there's a pattern if you reach you read down through my reviews people are happy with their purchases uh the vast majority of the time they're thrilled so um anyway you got the reviews yeah don't get offended if uh if i if you make an offer and i don't respond it sits there for the two days and dies um and then you want to make another offer make another offer i'm i'm not going if you want to message me i'm I'll respond to the messages. Um, I just don't respond to every offer. Um, and I'm around as well also. I mean, I'm also, I'm on YouTube all the time. People can, uh, everybody knows you can talk to me there. Um, on uh, the website, I respond to all the comments and emails. Um, and also on Facebook, um, on the, the Dependable Flame page on Facebook as well as uh, I mean I'm in the lighter groups on there as well OTLS Facebook group and the vintage uh, cigarette lighter collectors club Facebook group um, so anyway if you want to hit me up and uh, I'm I'm open to offers I just uh, I just literally don't have time to uh, respond to each and every one of them so I believe that was basically what I was wanting to show. The um, current eBay listings page leading over to our listings on eBay and also the galleries here on the dependableflame.com website and back to our YouTube channel. So if you enjoy these kind of videos, if you like old lighters, ashtrays, tabacchiana, other useful mechanisms, please subscribe to the channel. Like the video that you're watching. Tell your friends about the channel. Hit the share button. Um, send it off in an email or text, social media, 
however it is that you communicate with people and uh, let them get a look at it themselves <clears throat> comment below any questions that you may have as i said um man i am open to communication about selling the lighters i just uh, it's overwhelming sometimes the the number of offers that i'll get on on uh through the ebay interface uh, also uh, social media facebook twitter pinterest if you would like us across all those platforms until next time